morning. So early. <laughs> it's gonna be loud. Oh, the build? Maybe, you'll see. I don't know how exactly it was lewd. What's Arun doing? <laughs> Hi, puppy. <laughs> Jules, finally? Yeah, I think it just finished shipping, right? I think everyone should have received their jewels by now. No J with the 17 months. Thank you. Gachi Gosu. What is that? Thank you. <laughs> Ethan, thank you so much for the prime sub. Inathrin with the 14 months. Thank you. And Puffer Cat with the bits. Thank you. Nice cup. Ooh, yeah. Hello. Oh, wait. Where's chat? Oh, there we go. Got a big mug finally. I just finished eating KFC, it was not good. How can you say KFC is not good? KFC is so good. Oh, I love KFC. Will there be extras? Do you know? Of the jewels? Yes. I'm probably certain there will be. <laughs> Thank you so much for the 14 months. How are you doing? I'm still using the beans you got me. <laughs> week... I guess this is week three. <laughs> A week two? Week three. The Rwanda beans. Still on intermittent fasting? Uh, somewhat, yes. You're gonna be using the same beans for the next two months? I think it's gonna last more than two months. Have you done any builds with 6 space spacebar? Just the one last night and this thing is tiny. Oh my goodness, uh, I don't know if I've done a build recently. Was it 7v that I had a 6u? I did one pretty recently, I forget which one. Uh, it might have been 7v, right? Either 7v or some other build. Had a... Oh, TCV3 supports 6u too? Wow, okay, I don't know that. I don't think I've seen one built with that yet. Two seconds. Thank you so much for the five gifted. Oh my goodness. How are the cats? They're doing great. Retro Maple, they're going to 16 months as well. Uh, Spacey with one year. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Oh, Soran! I got, I installed 7TV or whatever. I made you an editor too. You can add emotes now. We have zero enabled emotes. <laughs> but we have 200 slots to fill. Yeah, I just, who else should I add as an editor? Oh, sorry about black bars. Wait, so should I disable everything else now? Should I disable BTTV and Frankerface Z? Do I need both of them still? Did you install it in FFZ? No, I did not. I installed it independently, I think. Does it matter if I do it through FFZ or not? When installing films, I don't know if I should flip them. Any help? Ah, crap. Supposedly, there is an orientation to it. I never really paid attention. Let me look it up for you. I think it's matte side up. But I never really care. Yeah, matte side should be up. Glossy side down. Shiny side up? Maybe it depends on the on the uh, the brand. I know for I've been told by Mr. Whole Tank. Uh, at least if you're using the uh, desk keys switch films, matte side should be up. I don't know if it's different for other brands, but yeah, I don't think it really makes a difference for me. Why are you in 60 FPS? On my laptop, it says 60, but normally it says 24. Uh, ever since I switched to 1440p, you can only do 1440p 60 FPS, but I'm not actually streaming at 60 FPS. <laughs> Matt side up on this key? Yeah, that's what I've been told. 
You can remove both BTTV and 7T as browser add-ons. Uh, oh, okay. So remove BTTV and 7T TV as browser. Remove them. Ooh, do I want to leak all my extensions? And then just install the FFC plugins for emotes. Okay, let's try doing this. I'm on FFZ. Where is the stuff about emotes? Huh? Where do you add? Open Twitch? You want me to open Twitch? Open Twitch. Oh, here! Ah, uh, I hate Franker faces ease. Ah! Wait, it's already enabled. It's enabled. I don't even have BTTV enabled on FFZ. <laughs> Am I good now? Enable it. Oh, chat repetition detector. Oh, anti-spam? What is deck? Nah. Mod tools, add new section for making modding easier, sure. New account highlighter. Ooh, new account highlighter. This sounds interesting. Pronouns to chat? No, that's gonna fill it up. Breaker face Z. Okay, I have this on. All right, nice. What if we want to spam? Uh, I won't enable spam. Spam is part of Twitch. You can't disable spam on Twitch. The kid in the candy store. All right, shall we get to the build? We got one thing to unbox though. I don't know who sent this, but I found an Amazon package in my PO box. What is this? Oh. This is a mouse? Pixar <laughs> sport. This guy always sends me the weird weirdest Amazon gifts. Why did why does he waste money like this? Ergonomic wireless mouse. Cool Iron Man mouse. Alright, let's see what this is. Well, thank you, Suspores, for <laughs> sending this to me. M8, steel iron. This is a very sus gift. You have to use it for a month? <sighs> my, my, uh, my, oh my goodness. What the heck? This is kind of cringe. <laughs> it's so small. And there's a there's a lip here that when you use it, like your palm digs into it. Oh no, this has a... It's not even like a tack... It's pretty domey. There's barely any travel on this. Turn it on. Does it light up? It doesn't even ship with batteries!
Ooh, it lights up. How do I connect this to my... I don't think my PC has Bluetooth. We've, we've tried connecting things to my computer on stream. It usually does not work. <laughs> There's a dongle inside? There wasn't. Where's the box? In the battery compartment? Oh! Oh! I see it. Turn this off first. Ah, sneaky, sneaky. <laughs> bracelet does look clean? Yeah, look, chat. Jen got me a bracelet this past weekend. How's it look? It's a gift from Jen. Truly game changing? This is big brain. Ooh, setting up 2.4G receiver. Oh, it works. All right, fine. I'll use this mouse for the stream. But Susports isn't even here. This, this mouse is pretty ass though, not gonna lie. Not ergonomic. The, the, the mouse clicks are terrible feeling. Would not recommend. <laughs> Okay, that's it for the unboxing. Let us get to the build. Sick mouse, bro. You have to use it for a month? Okay, we want more Gen on stream? Okay, I'll try. She doesn't live with me, so she can't always make it up. Do you have the MT3 Iron Man keycaps? I do not. So I've been sitting on this. Oh, actually not that long. Since March of this year. Oh? Ooh, we got sent NK stabs. For the jewels bill. Oh, <laughs> there's nothing else. Okay. <laughs> a man on the trumpet going wild. I see you have received the mouse. Hello, Suspores. I am currently using it. I will use this. I don't know about a month. I'll I'll try to use it for at least a week. <laughs> All right, these are the two components. We've got the jewels. Uh, where do I open this? This is the top. Box J's are sus? What do you mean? What is your feeling on cannon keys? I've been seeing people hate on them recently. What? Who's been hating on cannon keys? I don't know if this cannon keys hate. Did, did they do something about it? I love them. Tupas is a he's a great guy. I've personally never had issues with cannon keys. What drama is there surrounding cannon keys? I just built my f oh oh. What is that? Yeah, I should not reveal that. <laughs> Uh, the the two boxes. Ooh. 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 The Look at this. Yeah, let me move all this away first. Hold on. packaging. Did I build a prototype? I don't remember. 
But this is definitely the first production unit. Jewels. Oh, that's nice. They even got the Hunger Sub-Legend? Wow, that is nice. Foundry? Ooh. Zombumon? Ooh. Jewels, 65%. But before we unbox it, let's check out the tools. <laughs> Not even Zombumon logo? Oh, hello, Shiva. Okay. Ooh, they got the Zombumon Rama keycap. A dirty bag of Rama switch puller, standard Rama cable. Uh, some extra screws and torques. Got the Rama's feet. And then PCB and plate. Alright. Whoa, we have a new founder, Tonig. Hello. Or did you name change from before? Long time no see. Where do I find AIO3 Vega available? There are no Vega O3s available at the moment. We will have to wait until a future round happens. The group by four has finished. Ooh. Oh, there's only this in the box. Seven hundred on Mech Market. Wait, Vegas are really going for seven hundred? Where's the... Mech market is off its tits. <laughs> okay, let's see what color this client chose. Sheesh! That looks pretty nice. House on Mech Market is terrible around 2k. Yeah. This is the jewels. Oh, something is. No, it's probably just not tightened all the way. Oh. Side profile. Fat nut, I got the same color, so I'm biased. Very nice. Uh, yeah, nothing to, I mean, pretty good quality. It's Rama. What, what else do you expect from Rama at this point? The matte black does attract, ooh, it does attract fingerprints very quickly. There's the, nice. This here's a little dirty. But I think it'll come off with washi. All right, let's build. Let's build this. New PCB. Let's install the feet. 60% jewels would be pog. Um, I'm sure that's gonna happen one day. Are you gonna build Skara Sequence 2? Uh, not that I know of. I had the Sequence 1, so I didn't join in on Sequence 2. Can't wait for that clicky monkey type. It has been a while since we've done monkey type. We're actually just built with clickies in general on this stream. Oh, 
Number one revision to sign ship this week. Yeah, I saw the key called pink today. This morning. Is this a personal build? No, this is a client build. Uh, I like the rounded back plate there. It looks nice in the gold. Yeah. What music do you use? I have a command exclamation playlist or exclamation music. Do you think botanicals will go for round three? Mm, I think there's a good chance it might. Botanical, I feel like it's a, uh, it's a really nice set. It's, it's gonna, it's pretty popular. Why isn't there any content on Taya Pipes? I am not going to upload to there. Oh, actually, I do need to upload to Taya Pipes. My money is put on, it's been frozen because I've been inactive for too long. They said they won't pay me out because I've been inactive. So, so I've got to post something so I can get paid up. All the efforts of my two subscribers to Taya Pipes. <laughs> it's my money's being held up though. Pretty sad. Right. Better give him good content. <laughs> This is a solderable PCB. You have clips of that guy licking your board. True, maybe I should just post. I do have the clip of Tim licking my key cult. I've got the timestamp and the clip. Dude, this mouse sucks. I hate this mouse. <laughs> Should we show it? Dude, someone already timestamped it. Oh crap, my mouse isn't plugged in. Can someone link me to Taya Tapes? Mm, oh, I know, I know, I know, I know. I know, I know, I know. But yes, this is big brain. <laughs> Where's the timestamp? Dude, this still hasn't processed past 360. Wait, I can't scroll with this. This mouse sucks. Yeah, I gotta change. Wait, I can't scroll, period. Huh? Wait, hold on. It's highlighting everything. What is going on? Okay, oh, there we go. 2651. No, that's not it. Where is the timestamp? Oh, who erased the timestamp? No, someone got rid of it. Yes, it is, Casey. Someone had linked. GG, it's gone. I swear someone timestamped it. It's okay, we'll continue with the build. If I lick your mouse, I bet it'll work. I don't know about that. <laughs> Okay, let's try using this again. Test matrix. Please make sure the plate fits the case since there were some instances where the plate did not match the case. Typed on my jewels. I see. Casey never gonna let me near the... <laughs> Check the layout. 
Uh, I believe we are actually splitting backspace today. Well, I'm just gonna plug my keyboard in. Okay, we are splitting backspace, seven new bottom row, and regular caps. Interesting. Layout, split backspace, seven new. Already tested the first row. Stepped caps is the way. Uh, I don't. I don't necessarily dislike regular caps. Unnecessary stuff. Also, unplug this for now. It's PCB though. A big nut. Okay, we got some novel key stabs today. You need to buy the Belle Delphine bar. No TY, I don't want to be associated with her. <laughs> she is not someone I want to associate with. Okay, we need left shift, enter, and 7 U. Has anyone heard anything from Jack Static? I think that's a question a lot of people have. Some of, some of my clients who are waiting on the Rukia that I was supposed to build, I think they are considering just backing out because Jax has been unresponsive. Uh, did you see Gasket Double O got an update? I didn't see the update. I did hear, I did, I do know there's an update. I think Hoffman, Hoffman stepped in a little bit and it got a little spooky. But I did hear about, I did hear there was an update this morning. But I did not read it. Bell Dolphin is in chat right now. Okay, nice try, buddy. Wrong brush, wrong brush. Chargeback is the only way. Uh, a bolt, thank you so much for the bits. One drunk man, thank you for the one year. Uh, Dave Gandhi with the seven months. Alpha, thank you so much for the 16 months. Hexophile with the five month, thank you. It's links with the tier one sub, thank you. Freaking Tim, I know you guys are trolling. <laughs> uh, are you ever scared of spilling your drinks? Not really. I've yet to spill liquid on my keyboard. Maru coffee is so good? Yeah. Is a red velvet inspired board coming soon? Nah. Ooh, I, f I just saw the Sunmi video yesterday. It was pretty dank. Here's the lick. Ooh, let's see. <laughs> he 
He's so cute. <laughs> Dude, even, even in 360p, you could see the trail of spit. Even in 360p. Watch it with sound. Oh, it, it does have sound on. You can't hear me shout. Wait, did you shout when he licked it? I watched this part. Or was it before or after? Go back 30 seconds, Sora makes an appearance. Dude, this mouse sucks. Dude, if Kiko sees this, they're never gonna let me touch any of their boards. Dude, are you gonna sit for a commission right there? Yeah, they're they're. I have a commission from someone else. Stop right there, criminals come! Oh, shoot! <laughs> <laughs> what the heck? Did you call him criminal scum? Is the kids Dude, that's toxic. <laughs> Oh my goodness. <laughs> oh, that's kind of loud. Oh my, that's wet. Oh, what's up, Tony? How are you doing? Ooh, I also saw... Oh wait, I, can I... I shouldn't leak Discord, but... How can I leak this? Hmm... Oh, I removed my Discord scene. Mm, actually, I can I can do this. Dude, someone posted a really dank board. That patina. Sheesh! And then they posted a close-up. That's pretty sexy. I think this is one of the nicer patinas I've seen. And I think this is... This is probably artificial patina. I don't think they did this naturally through use, but it looks really nice. It is really nice. I guess we could open original. Oh, that is massive. That's pretty sexy. You ready to get some free patina from Tim's Lick? Sure, I'm down. I'm down for a streak of patinaing. Yeah, I built my first ever keyboard the other week. Nice. How much for you to lick my keyboard? I am not going to lick your keyboard. <laughs> $500 and I'll lick it. If you really want me to lick it. That is the price of my tongue. Give him B back an indirect kiss by licking it? No, someone else licked it afterwards. I think it was Frank. I think, if I remember correctly, he licked the same spot. But he didn't know about it. Uh, I roll Raptor, thank you for the 11 months. Here's to licking? <laughs> no, I'm not gonna lick. <laughs> Boggs with the Prime, thank you. Halfness with the Prime, thank you. Literally spreading COVID on stream ban. I'm negative, I tested negative. Uh, if I'm local Los Angeles and have a board I want built, are you taking commissions now or still not? I am... Ooh, I might be opening end of this month. 
how much for you to send my keyboard and you just hold it and send it back? Why would you, why would you spend money on that? Yo, get finger lady back on stream. She cute. <laughs> we'll see. He doesn't live locally to me. There is a new variant of COVID is going around by made by licking keyboards. Okay. Okay, guys. How is blue shirt guy? Blue shirt guy is doing great. How much for you to send me a free? Okay, so. Sprite guy is the cutest. Were you in Sprite guy's stream yesterday? KXM Mew? He streamed yesterday. Are you going to be doing more friend streams? It was actually pretty fun. Yeah, I definitely have more in mind. Uh, it's not going to be a regular thing, but yeah, I do have some segments that I'm thinking. I could probably teach. I thought it might be fun to like bring on friends who don't know anything about keyboards, who are interested in learning. You can like prepare a small kit that uh, I could prepare for them and I can teach them how to build it live on stream. Um, or it might be cool to like swap hobbies with some of my friends. Kind of like, not blind, but I mean, not, not exchange hobbies, but I can't formulate the words for it. Bring BTMC to build his keyboard? Oh, yes, I'm gonna try to help him out for that. I'll teach you how to tag weld? Oof. That sounds fun, actually. Do you accept all boards for commish or just high end? I accept all boards. I would buy a Teja starter kit. What's a Teja starter kit? What are your thoughts on the Freebird 60? Can you link me it? I don't think I've seen it. Yeah, but I... I've been trying to find ways to incorporate keyboards with non-keyboard stuff, if that makes sense. Without it being explicitly keyboards. Does that make sense? I think that's the direction I want to take my channels. Freebird 60. Oh, 135? Is this aluminum? Tray mount, it looks like. Uh, what is that? What's the, where's, what does the PCB look like for this? Oh my goodness. That is Swiss cheese. It seems pretty interesting. One, 135 for that seems not too bad, actually. I haven't tried it though. Uh, Tony and XX Dubs did build streams on the Freebird 60 tray mount with O rings. Oh, it even has O rings! Wow. Wait, gummy O ring or what? What kind of O ring? Ed is building KC with Euro next Sunday. Oh, okay. I didn't know if I could leak it or not. Yeah, I knew about that. I guess I could leak it then. <laughs> I don't know if it was a surprise or a leak. I will try to stop by. Uh, definitely really nice kit for 135. Yeah, 135 is a, is a great price point. Assuming they can deliver on it. Are they already delivering on it or is it in production? Well, I guess it's a group buy, so it hasn't shipped yet. Mm. 
Not gummy, just on the train mount post. Ah, I see. Free bird is pretty banging for your buck. Yeah, I think so. Haven't tried it, but it looks like it. Halfness with the prime, Bob's with the prime, IRL Raptor. Things from the eleven. Oh wait, I already read all these. Thank you, thank you. Uh, any plans on doing merch collab with vendors? Yes, I am working on. Should I leak my next desk mat design? I've already. I'm already. We're just waiting on samples for the next desk mat run. And we, I am working on another round of keyboard cases, keyboard carrying cases. I don't know what to call my next desk mat though. Because the first, the first desk mat I put out, we called that the Teotypes desk mat. <laughs> so should I make this next one like an independent name? Or how do I make it a continuation series? Because I don't want to call it Teotypes Desk Mat version 2. TT Desk Mat 2? <laughs> TT Desk Mat 2 sounds a little troll. Did I leak it? Should I? Eh, we'll see. We'll wait until samples and then I'll post about it. Yeah. Oh, also update on actual merch. Product I've been told production has finished. I don't know if I told chat. Production is finished. Now it is just a one to two month wait of freight shipping. Assuming there's no delays. Assuming no more ships get stuck in the Suez Canal. I should have it. In a couple months, hopefully. Which means... It will drop before the year ends, so you guys can get some nice, cozy Teotypes merch before the holidays. Before it gets too cold. Also, hope for no pirates. Oh yes, we gotta hope for no pirates. You never know, those pirates, you know, sometimes we've heard of them stealing keycaps and desk mats. You gotta hope these pirates don't steal my merch. <laughs> Hoodie? Yes, I have several hoodies lined up. And some t-shirts. Can you lick? No, I'm not gonna lick the merch before sending it out. It's bad. No, that is not, that is not the move. Have you leaked the designs? It, it's been leaked on my Patreon. Uh, my top tier Patreon patrons have seen, they've, I've told them about the whole process. I've been posting about it on my Patreon. If you want early leaks. Ship it to Germany? Yes, it'll be... It'll have worldwide shipping. Share the new desk mat design in DM and I will help you come up with name. Is, this, is Soran gonna be troll? Soran. Oh shoot, I didn't read your last message. <gasps> Does he hate me too? Okay, I'll do it after stream. I didn't- I missed this. Um, Crap. Where's my file for it? Hold on. Hold on. So bright. 
Where's Soran? I can't believe you still have that mouth on your desk. I'm gonna try to use it for a, a week. Have you tried a NIS board? Yes. I like NIS boards. They're slightly different from actual Topra, I would say. But I like NIS. I should actually buy some of the recent models. I've been meaning to. Yeah, I, I recommend I recommend NIS to a lot of people too. You're gonna leave my wallet dry after your merch plus a desk mat? Yumcha, you can. I'll let you just grab one. Relax, you don't need to worry about it. This actually looks better than the previous one. Oh, really now? Soran's just gonna reverse troll me. I can feel it. <laughs> Will you find models to promote your merch? Yes, I already have a photo shoot lined up. And we're gonna have a lookbook. I guess, I guess I could leak the photographer, huh? You guys might know the photographer. He has made appearances on my stream. He is a Tia Types regular. <laughs> Wearable desk mats, no. I just realized non-enthusiasts look for Bluetooth a lot and this is a great recommendation. Uh, that is true, yes. Except for the Switch. A lot of people might not necessarily like a Switch. Are you even gonna come to the warehouse today? Uh, no, not today. I don't know when I'll be there next. Because I already checked out the hoodies. <laughs> oh, I gotta pick up your beans. Crap. I can't stop by today, though. Have you ever experienced a rattling sound on certain keys on a Topra board? Yes, that is possible if your, sp your springs are misaligned under your domes, as well as if your domes are misaligned under the housing. But generally more so because of the spring. It was split backspace? Yes. Oh crap, I meant to put that on enter. That's supposed to go on enter. Will there, will there be Teha coffee merch available? Mugs, etc. Yes, I did tease the mugs on the subathon. I am also working on some ceramic espresso mugs. Handmade. Uh, I, I was in talks with a local micro roaster on potentially getting some beans done as well, but I think I have too many projects at the moment. Duroc T1's any good? Yes. This is supposed to go here. My control key isn't getting picked up anymore. Bible thump. GG. Time to replace the switch. Have you seen the streamer sponsored by King's Coast Coffee? What? Are they big streamers or what? I've never heard. I don't watch much Twitch. <laughs> but that's cool if they're sponsored by a coffee company. I'd love to get sponsored by coffee companies. I feel like coffee companies are relatively safe, brand safe too. Like you don't lose out on much getting sponsored by a coffee company. Unless their coffee is like trash, then you don't want to be associated, but Dude, I would take a coffee sponsorship. You have successfully avoided the Twitch brain rot? Yeah, I don't know. As of late, I haven't been really watching Twitch. I haven't even been watching YouTube all that much. I've been trying to... I don't know, I've just been enjoying 
life outside of all that because it, it feels a little endemic after a certain point. And I needed a I need I need a breather from it. <laughs> I mean, nothing wrong with like platforms being endemic and you know people just collabing with each other all the time. But I need some I need some fresh eyes and a fresh fresh perspective. Uh, JoJo Part Six in December. I've been consuming less overall, but that's also because New Job has shit wireless collection. Sag. Did you watch Hungarian Grand Prix? No, I need to start following the races now. Now that I have finished- Ooh! Now that I have finished the docu. Where do you keep- How do you keep up with the races? Is there a subreddit for F1, I'm guessing? Oh man, I don't want to touch this plate. Is this the revised plate? I don't know, how can you tell? Are there- are there issues with the plate? Oh yeah, someone did say I should check that the plate fits, huh? Do I, I should open up the case then? Did Zombumon design this board? Yes. I should open up the board. Uh, Formula Dank is a gold mine. I just watched the highlights on the F1 YouTube channel. Is that an all brass bottom? I believe so. No, I don't think this is brass. It's not brass bottom. Good budget case that isn't the tofu. Well, it looks like this Freebird 60 is not too bad. Okay, I'm gonna remove this. This is taking up too much space. Oh no! Uh, if you're looking for all metal. You can also go for the NK Entry, sorry, NK65 uh, Aluminum Edition. Uh, what other cheap aluminum boards are You can also go for... Oh, Icky Aurora, I haven't tried that, but it seems like that's very popular too. You could also go for... Uh, GMMK Pro is kind of in that price range too. Did you say you like Haas? Yes. I'm going to root for the underdog, Haas. <laughs> after, after watching the documentary, I think my favorite drivers are... I like Seb. I think Seb's pretty troll. But he's like a competent troll, you know? And he does whatever he wants. Verstappen? I didn't really like Verstappen after the documentary. Ricardo? Ricardo? I don't like his vibes. He gives me bad vibes too. He's very cocky. <laughs> I don't like Ricardo. Uh, oh, I like Leclerc. Leclerc is pretty dank. Um, how do I check if this fits? Should I just screw it in? They did Verstappen wrong in the dock? Ooh. Oh, Lando? Yeah, I like Lando. He seemed like a nice guy. It looks like it fits. What issues should I be looking for? Seems like the plate fits. Is this the updated plate? 
Carlos? Oh, Carlos uh, Saints? Yeah, he seemed pretty nice. I liked how they, I liked his story in the documentary. Oh, I still don't know what May Spin is. He wasn't featured in the documentary. Where do I read up on this May Spin drama? I don't know what drama surrounds May Spin. It's, it's pronounced Mazapin. Mazapin. I want to see Schumacher on top though, like one day. Schumacher. Oh, he's the the son or grandson, right? Of Michael Schumacher. No love for Botas? Yeah, I didn't really care for Botas after the documentary. <laughs> Lewis Hamilton seems dope. Dude, life is so unfair. Imagine being Lewis Hamilton. He's good looking, has so many world titles, makes hell of money. Must be nice, man. Some people just have it all. <laughs> no one cares for Botas, sadly? Yeah. <laughs> Hamilton is so dreamy? Yeah. Oh, Kimmy. Kimmy seemed like an odd person in the in the documentary. He just seemed very, like, aloof. They didn't really talk much about Kimmy. I just know he's a decent driver, or he's a good driver. But that's about it. Lewis is a big no-no? Oh, is there Lewis drama? What drama is there around Lewis? He hates interviews. Oh, makes sense. Botas has a tough TBH. It's so hard to compare to Lewis. Yeah, I do agree. I, I do feel bad for Botas. Like, it must suck. Lando Norris for the win. Yeah, Lando seems like he, uh, he's got a lot of potential. He's so young. He has so much, so much ahead of him. Lewis took out Verstappen intentionally at Silverstone. What? Wait, so he committed... Wait, does that, did that also knock Lewis out? How do you take someone out intentionally? Wouldn't that also wreck his car? Lando is also a Twitch streamer. I heard, he owns a... Uh, doesn't Lando also own like an esports org or something? Lewis stayed in the race. Oh. No rattle. No rattle, just all click. All right, nice. He forced a turn which caused them to collide, then boom. I have no idea what that just said, what that meant, but okay. <laughs> That's pretty nice for a clicky. Yeah, if you guys like clicky switches, uh, box jade and box navies, box whites are probably my favorite. Uh, readily accessible click. Yeah, navies are a little bit too heavy for me. I'd probably go white or jades. If you really like clickies. He carried more speed into the corner, understeered, and mixed the apex. I see. Yo, Ed! Good morning! When am I gonna get invited to your house? Housewarming party. Where's the BTMC housewarming party? Also, I heard you're looking for a stylist. Would you like to dye your hair with me? I'll probably read change my color in like a month. Bro, I did invite you. What do you mean? 
mean? That wasn't to a housewarming party. <laughs> Are links allowed? Uh, you have to be a sub. Ed, I hear you're trying to date. Or then you're trying to get married. You're trying to marry a VTuber, right? How's that going? Have you found a woman of interest or ma man of interest after moving to Los Angeles? Has anyone struck your inner strings, your heart strings? He's got in the bag. <laughs> Kimi Raikkonen, best actor. Let's see. Thanks. Well, Check John DMs? Bob. Okay. Bob. Hold on, let me pause my music. You are my man of interest, love. How are you liking LA though? Or living with Boxbox Box on the crew? It seems like you're happy. I've, I've been lurking in your streams. Okay, driving. Let's know what you need. I don't know how uh, understeer and oversteer works. As a, as a noob to this sport, it seems unintentional. And I, have, I don't care for either driver. <laughs> Most commentators said Lewis fault, but racing incident. Mm. I see. It is what it is. Race car politics? Dude, there's actually so much politics and drama, Ed. There's a there's a lot of politics. Dude, it's it's what happens when every time money gets involved. Once you get big money from big players, it's always politics. I also heard that like all of the companies or like the majority of companies that like sponsor these F1 cars, they're all like side businesses for these rich people. Is that true? Is it just another means to move money around to avoid taxes and dilute your the, the mound of money they're sitting on. I thought it was a marketing thing for cars. I mean, it is a means of marketing, yes. But there's also politics and drama behind it. Just the rich get richer. There's literally people who own multiple competing teams. Damn, you ever hear of the fake businesses that sponsor F1 teams to make a quick buck? No, I haven't. How does that work? Rich energy tech that wait, what does this rich energy mean? <laughs> there was a Porsche team in the 70s entirely sponsored from cocaine. Ooh, dude, that car must have been cracked. Cracked out. Probably won first. Did their drivers do coke? Ooh, is there drama around drivers using illegal substances? Would some wouldn't some drugs help drivers out? A fake energy drink company who was Haas's primary sponsor. Oh, Rich Energy! Wait, they were in the uh, they were in the documentary, right? I thought they pulled out though. Didn't didn't Rich Energy pull out because Haas was doing so poorly? <laughs> I feel like Adderall will help. Yeah, I feel like maybe Adderall might help with drivers. I don't know. They pulled out and disappeared because they weren't, oh, they weren't real. What? They weren't real? That's crazy. Seven Sirens, thank you so much for the one year. Die Potata, thank you so much for the five months. Prime Sub, don't renew anymore. Uh, Prime Subs never renew. You have to manually renew Prime Subs. Low pie, thank you so much for 25 months. <laughs> Jury with the prime sub as well, thank you. 
same arts flow after 14 months. Dude, I love your mouse, it's awesome. Dude, I hate my mouse, it's trash. <laughs> but a friend of mine sent me this to use. So I'm using it out of love for my friend. <laughs> this sucks. That mouse is insane. It's literally off Amazon. I unboxed it today. It's an Iron Man mouse. This is this feels ass. The the mouse clicks are atrocious. <laughs> that sounds kind of ungrateful. <laughs> I mean, I'm just saying. <laughs> well, hello, Justin. I'll be the better friend and get you a dank mouse. Ooh. No, it's not, it's not the switch problem. There's no travel in this. Also, there is no switch. It's just a membrane in there. I, you would have to replace the switch. Yeah, uh, I, I, I did like Carlos Saints. He seems like a pretty nice guy. Very hardworking. Who else did I like? Magnuson? I kind of like Magnuson too. He seems pretty cool. Uh, Carlos Sainz is awesome. Ooh, is he good? Nice. Oh, uh, what's his name? Pierre? Pierre Gasly? He seemed pretty nice too. Is he back in F1? You sound exactly like someone who doesn't watch F1. Yes, I don't watch F1 anymore. Oh, I mean, I don't, I just got into F1. He's not an F, well, I know Pierre Gasly got bumped down to F2. Is he still on, is he still in F2? Uh, how has no one mentioned Gros, Rome, Gros John? Dude, I don't know how he was on the team, man. I mean, nothing against Gros John, Gros Jean. But that guy was just bad luck. <laughs> Legit, throughout the whole documentary, Rosejun just had car issues. He just crashed. Dude, that fire, the... Actually, the spoilers. No spoilers. Uh, are those switches lubed? Yes, I have... I've been told they're lubed. I don't know how they lubed it, though. I can definitely feel some residue lube though rubbing off. Uh, Grows. Oh, Magnuson is out of the sport too? What? I liked him. The Better Haas Driver. What is the name of the documentary? I think it's uh, Drive to Survive. If you just Google, not Google, if you just search F1 on Netflix, it should pop up. Grows, grows John, okay. Your hair is very gray. Did you age 40 years? Yes, I am now 50, I'm now 59. <laughs> uh, what is the benefit of lubing clickies? You can lube the springs at a minimum, which reduces a little bit of that rattling, rattling noise. Uh, the box design is different where you can technically lube certain aspects of it without inhibiting the click mechanism too much. So it can translate to a smoother feel, but the, the box design also kind of makes lubing pointless. Eventually over time, it, uh, it will self remove debris from the switch. Uh, you can lube MX clicky switches too, but usually not recommended. Most chan most people will probably end up ruining the switch unless you've had enough practice with it. I've had some success success experimenting with lubing the side rails. Yeah, you can lube the side rails very slightly. It's possible, but it's 
I don't think it's worth the effort for a clicky switch. Also pretty hard to get consistent. How's it going? Hello, I'm doing pretty good. How are clicky and tactiles different? Uh, clicky switches generate an audible click noise. Uh, clicky switches, I would say, also tend to be... They tend to have a sharper tactile event than most tactile switches. Because you have to generate that click noise somehow, um, and usually is a result of building up energy and releasing it very quickly. So clicky switches generally are sharper if you like a sharper tactile feel. Uh, Marshawn Lynch, king of NFL. Dude, Lynch, he's GOAT. He's a Cal grad too, go Bears. Oh, it is too long. I don't want to get, I don't want to get content struck. <laughs> is that iced Americano? No, it's just a iced pour over. All right, let's get to soldering. Go Bears. I'm just kidding. I don't have that much Cal prep. Why hasn't someone made silent clickies? Why would you want a silent clicky? You can just get a silent tactile. Tech W. Uh, building a sim rig and whatnot. Ooh, I mean, if I was rich, I wouldn't mind having a sim rig. Well, I don't have that kind of money to blow. <laughs> They're gonna announce... Oh, right, they did leak Silent Jades. Okay, I forgot. I forgot. Silent Jades are gonna be a... Hmm... <clears throat> There you go. Whoever asked for silent clickies, Novel Keys is working on one at the moment. Uh... Sponsor segment. There are pretty affordable sim rigs. Yeah, but you know me. If I'm gonna build out a sim rig, I want it to be nice. You know what I'm saying? You like the way you think? Have you bought any new cameras, Ed? What are some new gear pickups you've done, Mr. Ed? How much have you blown through? Any new keyboards? Gear? How much did you drop on Genshin? I'm still on the A7S3? Nice. That's the, still a great camera. F2P Supremacy? What's F2P? I met up with Albert Chang and got his fancy SD card. Oh! Wait, SD card for what? Free to play. Oh, free to play. I see. <laughs> free to play is pretty nice. Retold or Hyperglide MX Browns? I don't think it matters too much. It's still going to be luck of the draw dependent. I guess go Hyperglides just to... Yeah, it's really luck of the draw. Uh, interesting, then sharper tactile feel, just no noise. I'm curious how you would cancel out the sound. I, I think it is mechanically doable, JL. You could, you could probably find a way to make a, a tactile switch that has the sharpness of a clicky switch without generating a noise. Um, I'm not a mechanical engineer. I don't know what the best way to engineer that would be, but I'm sure someone could figure it out. Like you could probably make the bump Omega sharp. I don't know. 
Uh, the card and card reader is like 500 bucks. Wait, what card does the A7S3 use? CF Express? What temp are you on? 356 Celsius. All right, it is time for sponsor time. We've got several sponsors of Tia Types. First one being KBD fans. Head over to kbdfans.com where you can purchase tons of keycap sets, tons of keyboard kits, tons of switches, and keyboard accessories at a pretty affordable price. Check out kbdfans.com. The next sponsor is KeyCult. Head on over to keycult.com. If you guys aren't on their Discord server already, they made a pretty important announcement today. Make sure you guys go read it. But the biggest one being the number 265 in the black and unfinished purple will be raffled on the 16th at 10 a.m. EDT? Oh, 10 p.m. EDT. Wait, 10 p.m. EDT? Did I write that correctly? No, a.m. 10 a.m. 10 a.m. EDT. And it looks pretty nice. And just to just to clarify, it is not a raffle to win a free keyboard. You are entering a raffle to have the opportunity to pay for the keyboard. That is how high tier this board is. You have to get raffled to have the opportunity to pay for it. All right, don't enter thinking you're gonna get a free keyboard. But check out KeyCult, they make Fantastic keyboard kits. You guys already know if you've been in the hobby. Key cult is dink. <clears throat> Next we've got Novel Keys. Head on over to novelkeys.com. Uh, GMK Classic Retro Juin is currently live until a little bit before the month ends. Go check it out. It's a very nice set. And especially meaningful if you speak or write is it writing i don't i don't know what you and i okay i'm gonna stop talking <laughs> but go check it out um there's also tons of in stock products over at novel keys like the tia types desk mat if you guys missed out on the pre-order uh there's tons of switches like the ones we're using today you can pick up stabilizers Use code TEHAWKEYS at checkout to save 5% off in-stock Novel Keys items. Um, raffle invoice is a pretty common method of buying limited stock items in Japan. Yeah, it's pretty common for limited stock items in general, I feel like. Next, we have Omnitype. Head on over to omnitype.com slash types. GMK Botanical 2. Uh, it ends in a couple days, two days, right? Yeah, you only have two more days to join in on GMK Botanical 2. I uh, definitely recommend you guys purchase it if you guys are on the fence. It's a fantastic set. But you can also pick up several in-stock items from Omnitype, like their desk mat selections, uh, they've got keyboard carrying cases, keycap storage cases. Use code sweet tay at checkout to save 5% off in-stock Omni-type items. P. Flucker, thank you so much for tier one. Rock some things with 10 months as well. Do you like Desert or OG base for Botanical 2? I think I'm still a OG base guy for Botanical 2. I don't know if because I was conditioned to see it first. Also hard to predict what the desert would look like in person. It looks nice in renders though. Next sponsor we have is Prime Keyboards. Head on over to primekb.com slash types where you can pick up several products like the alpaca switches, uh, TTC switches, you can pick up lube stations, lube, switch openers, 
check out primekb.com slash types. Do you have any triple shot sets? I don't think so. The next sponsor that we have is SwitchMod. Head on over to switchmod.net slash types where you can purchase tons of lubricants. I use Crytox 205 grade zero for stabilizers, but all of SwitchMod's lubes are switch safe. Using my affiliate link saves you 4% off your lube purchases. And GMK Frost, which samples have been approved, I think. So if you guys joined in on GMK Frost, which uh, keep your eyes peeled. Why do you hate accessibilities when it comes to shows? You say dubs should not exist but I have dyslexia and I can't read subtitles fast. Dubs are how I am able to enjoy shows. I guess that is a good reason. It's not the accessibility I was hating on. It's more so, I feel like a lot, I feel like a lot of shows don't invest. Oh, I don't know, it's not even the investing, I feel like Maybe it's like a cultural difference, but like the way, the way dub actors convey emotions or sound, I feel like it gets, it gets lost in the translation, but that is a fair point. I do apologize for that. I guess I shouldn't say dub is bad then. There is a legitimate reason for dub. Dubs have had a really bad history of localization and quality. Things get lost in dub translations. Uh, I mean, I feel like, I feel like a lot of shows invest in translations. I have a lot of friends who translate for shows. So it's, it's not really the translation portion. It's just more so the conveying aspect. And yeah, it's just, I think, yeah. I don't know if that's a fault on the show or the production company or the specific country that handle. I don't know how dub is handled or like translation, but yeah, I, I, it's more, I'm more harping on, let's say the process. Most dub voice actors sound embarrassed or extremely forced when voicing their lines. But why though? Like that shouldn't be a problem, right? Translating. I feel like it's just bad casting, maybe. Casting, I think casting is the issue. Like, how does this line convey the same thing this character is trying to get at? No, I think, I think good voice actors, well, okay, I'm, I'm generalizing now. I don't know much about voice acting, but I feel like trying to understand what the character is conveying like you can get pretty close with enough time. Language differences, intonation and in other languages aren't conveyed properly in English. Okay, I, I guess I also generalized. My only experience with dub is watching English dubbed. And I do agree a lot of English dub, the voice actors sound very cringe. And I think that's a casting issue. I, I'm not, I am not speak, I don't speak for other dub languages, but English dub specifically, in my opinion, is very cringe. I'm a voice actor and know many dub actors. There are significant differences in the vocal practices between English and Japanese. Additionally, lines have to be adapted to match the lip flaps. Wait, what does that mean? Lines have to be adapted? Oh, so like when the animation moves, you're also speaking when it does. And that is difficult since Japanese is so different from English. I understand Japanese is very different from English and trying to like, you can't, you can't expect 100% refresh chatter, you know, you can't expect 100% uh, 
um, like transferring of intent and execution. But I feel like I don't know something about casting English. I don't know if like English American production companies just don't understand. Maybe I guess they just they don't understand Asian cultures. <laughs> Maybe have domestic voice actors who speak English to the dubs. That might be a good idea. Ima imagine if, you know, people who are actually, you know, have like cultural heritage were hired to do certain jobs. That doesn't happen too much in Hollywood. <laughs> Is it that hard to find? For example, like a Korean actor to play a Korean role in a movie. Is it that hard? Or to find like a Chinese actor to play a Chinese role in a Hollywood movie. It I, apparently is very hard. Not gonna lie, there are some really good dub voice actors though. Yes, okay, I, I was generalizing about dub. I do apologize. I, my experience with dub specifically is listening to American dub. You don't like the same three people voicing all the games and anime games? No, that's fine. Like that's, I think that's what separates <clears throat> a really good like voice actor, right? They have full control over their whatever throat. And like good singers, like skilled singers, they can change how they sound pretty drastically. <clears throat> That's not that. How a director or movie funder find actors to play certain roles is way different than what we think. Can you elaborate? I think a lot of it is due to bad voice direction and lack of budget. I guess budget. I don't know. Don't popular animes have hella budget though? Uh, dubbing studios usually aren't union jobs. They typically have a talent roster they hire from because there isn't a lot of money in dubbing. Anime dubs only pay 75 an hour. Wait. Anime dubs only pay 75 an hour. That's pretty good, no? 75 an hour? That's really good. <laughs> That's, it's dubbing. What do you mean? Dude, I, I wasn't even making 75 an hour as a software engineer. <laughs> There isn't a lot of dub work though. Oh, I see. I see. It's not a nine to five. I, see. I mean, even if it isn't a nine to five, 75 an hour is pretty good, no? Did you hear about the Enigma drama? No, I did not. It's not a stable job. I see. I can see it not being a stable job. That's true. Uh, also, American dubs work differently because all the actors are not in the studio together. I see. We all grew up on dub DBZ and that's how we just love it. Yes, I think DBZ is a good example of a well-dubbed show. I said that yesterday. Pokemon, it's been a while since I've seen Pokemon. But I was also very young when I watched it, so maybe I didn't care about dub versus sub back then. I was also probably too young to understand subtitles. So what don't you like about Cowboy Bebop? Well, I love Cowboy Bebop. Oh my Noster, thank you so much for the bits. Akiho Shinomoto, thank you for the prime. 
Drain damage, things are three months. FMA were both great dubs. I haven't seen FMA or Cowboy Bebop in dubs. Have you tried a dub recently? What was it? Yeah, I've I've seen One Piece dubs. I don't like One Piece dubs. <laughs> Not at all. Voice actor don't work 40 hours a week. They only get paid for what they're in the studio. Unless you're a main character, you may only work a couple hours a week. You spend 90% of your... You spend 90% of your work auditioning and you don't get paid to do that. I see. But even, even if... Hmm. I guess this is an industry problem then. How do you, how do you change this industry? Because I have also met a ton of voice actors through Twitch. Or I guess the Twitch the Twitch world happens to align a lot with some voice actors. So I've like learned here and there about voice acting. I think the industry is just too small. Maybe, maybe it's like a... It's like a chicken and the egg problem, right? The industry is small because currently a lot of dubs suck. So how do you fix? You got to fix both at the same time. People don't want to join, or I guess more people don't want to be voice actors because the industry is small, but the industry is small because the current pool is not so great. Maybe, I don't know. <laughs> You should reach out to Proz D and ask him. Dude, I would love to talk to Proz D. But I am I am too small. He won't recognize someone like me. I, I'm also I am also not that knowledgeable on like anime. I just watch here and there. I wouldn't call myself an expert. C Dog VA has a great voice. Never heard. Don't know who that is. We should really have someone talking from inside the industry. <laughs> that is not me, I'm sorry. I am not in the voice acting industry. Yeah, but it is. I keep thinking that something is shorting because of the jades. <laughs> Yeah, it is, it is very interesting though. Just like learning about different industries and like how they operate, how some things are allowed, some things aren't. Like I've been learning a lot about the music industry too, living out here just because like a lot of people are into music here or like the, uh, the production and like you know, the whole behind the scenes of actually putting out music. Man, I don't think I ever want to work in the music industry. <laughs> it's, it's a whole different world. This is a podcast subject for you? Maybe. Christian was giving industry insights? Yeah, I tuned in. I, I watched his stream afterward. Starting a company is actually pretty hard. Starting a company? I mean, yeah, that's that's just general though. Learn about industries with Teha. That'd be, that'd be down for that, actually. If people want to come on and expose their industries. Yeah, how do we, how do we fix music? It's such a ginormous beast that we've let run loose for so long I feel like trying to modernize the music industry is going to take maybe it won't happen during my lifetime <laughs> who knows Spill the tea, Nate. Expose the Twitch industry. <laughs> Why was Doc banned? <laughs> I don't know, man. I don't even watch Doc. You've got to ask Soran. Soran watches Doc. 
he's an avid Doc fan. <laughs> Music industry will never change. No, I think it will. I think it will, but it needs a bigger push. I don't think Twitch and live streaming is enough yet. I mean, who knows? Maybe live streaming blows up. Maybe one day Twitch gets on YouTube's level. But I don't see that happening anytime soon. I don't know if anyone can take on Universal, Warner, and Sony. Yeah, they are huge conglomerates. Plus, all the boomers that would actually enact a change don't listen to music. <laughs> or they do, but they probably re re listen on like vinyl records. They don't know about like music for content or different purposes. It's not gonna happen. <laughs> When is the duck, desk mat, and plush going to ship? Hello, daddy. Uh, you would have to ask Novel Keys and Solran about that. I am not affiliated with it. You can't fix the music industry until Spotify adds 2FA. What does 2FA have to do with music industry? Oh, like people sharing their Spotify accounts? 2FA has two-factor authorization. Okay, the plate is mostly fixed. We just gotta check back, split backspace, and caps lock. What are the rocks on the desk for? It's Shungite. I gotta get rid of the bad juju vibes. In my house, in La Casa, you know? What's the coffee choice today? Uh, these are Rwanda beans from Blue Bottle that Mr. Alres B dropped off during my subathon two weeks ago. To put it simply, dub actors working full time make around 50K a year. That's if they're booking regularly. In LA, that's honestly not a lot. The revenue from dubbing has to be split from the animation studio, distributor, translation team, and the audio engineers and the actor. At this point, we have to wait until anime becomes... At this point, we have to wait until anime becomes big time mainstream for it to pay similar to American animation. All right, chat. I think, I think this is the solution. All right, Costler V. He is, he or she or they are a voice actor. And we need to make anime big time mainstream. So I am pleading to all of chat. Please go watch One Piece. The best anime ever made. The best show ever made. All right. Go give One Piece a watch. We need to make anime mainstream. So these dub actors can get paid better. So that people who actually have a reason to watch dub can enjoy better dub all right everyone go watch one piece start from episode one it's on netflix now not the whole show but the first couple seasons are on netflix you can start watching from there and then watch the rest one piece is too long see you're part of the problem silent s h h h you're making anime not mainstream with these excuses and therefore, these dub actors aren't getting paid well. I just started watching yesterday. Nice. That's the... Are you caught up on manga? I don't read. <laughs> I don't read. I am caught up on the show though. Uh, okay, let's check bottom row. They must be taken care of. Okay.
50K is less than most welders and this is highly consumed media. They need to earn more. Yeah, considering some animes, the viewership they get. I mean, everyone should get a bigger cut of the pie. You type, yet you do not read. That is correct. Bottom row. Also, people don't pay for anime website subscriptions. Unique name Asaurus made a good video exposing Crunchyroll and why you shouldn't pay. Oh, well, I don't pay for Crunchyroll. Should you not be paying for Crunchyroll? I have some friends that pay for Crunchyroll. I also wish... Is there a way to like conglomerate all the <laughs> subscription services? I have way too many subscription services. I finally started paying for YouTube Premium. And it took me a long time. <laughs> I'm paying for YouTube Premium. I'm paying for uh, Netflix, Hulu, Disney Plus, HBO Max. Spotify. WTF do you get for YouTube Premium? You get no ads. Dude, I think, I think YouTube Premium is worth. Considering how much time I spend on YouTube, I waste a lot of time on ads. I just use Adblock. It doesn't work on mobile though. Like if you think about it, considering how many ads you're hit with on YouTube. The, the nice thing about YouTube also is a premium is you can watch, you can listen to music and uh, listen to watch videos while your lock screen is on. On mobile, you can use YouTube Vance, it's awesome. Yeah, but that's illegal. Is YouTube Vance even legal? Android? I'm not on Android though. <laughs> okay, caps, whoa, these look very... This is probably just the box switch shenanigans. Uh, box switches, you can't expect straightness because they are still kind of thick. Okay. Let's see if we missed a switch. Blue spots on your head. What? Where do I have blue spots? Pay for YouTube Premium using Indian VPN. <laughs> no TY. Justy Rubud my MX Brown Jetta Day and my Ducky on without the disorder. I have applied a right coat of cry tax 250 zero and the stems on the top side. Which gave me access to the screen. I did not touch the legs at all. Did I touch the left by switching? Nice. India is $1.5 a month. Wow, that is so cheap. 1.5 US dollars for YouTube premium? Holy crap, I'm getting scammed. Okay, actually I don't pay for Netflix because my family, my family's on T-Mobile and you get free Netflix with T-Mobile. So I guess I don't pay for Netflix. I can 
finish building this. Free Hulu with Sprint? Yeah, but imagine being on Sprint. I don't know many people that are on Sprint in LA. That T-Mobile deal is clutch? Yeah, low key, free Netflix is pretty clutch. I get HBO Max with my AT&T internet. That is clutch. That's pretty clutch. HBO Max has been putting out some dinks though. Oh, I think Disney Plus I'm also free. I think Chase, one of the cards offered free Disney Plus. I think my Disney Plus is free at the moment too. But I'll have to start paying soon. You get Hulu free with a Spotify subscription as well. I think that's for students, right? Am I being scammed? I'm, I've been paying for Spotify for years now. <laughs> I, I don't know about this free Hulu deal. All right, I'm gonna go wash my hands. Be right back. Hey, R. Barbosa, thanks for the tip. Just lubed my MX Browns today on my Ducky one without desoldering. I've applied a light coat of 205 grays around the stem and the top side. I have not touched the legs at all. Did I just wreck my switches? Uh, no? Wait, if how did you lube it? Depends on how well you lubed it <laughs> without soldering. Without desoldering, sorry. You can, it is possible to lube switches without desoldering. It's not very accurate, I would say, but you can lube. You can get a decent amount of lube in without the uh, If you lube, if you did a, assuming you did a light coat of 205 grade zero on the stem and top side, I don't think you lubed, uh, wrecked it. Real question is, does Tia Tice have a Vicky account? I do not. I uh, I don't watch much Korean dramas. Anymore. My extent of Korean dramas is whatever's on Netflix now. Since I'm paying for Netflix. Bouncy, thank you so much for the 22 months. Oh, let me take out Spacebar. Nearing two years and still waiting for Gasket and Rukia Kek W. GG. I have officially spent more on keeps than my PC cost. Nice. Okay, we need those screws. Do you still have your email from college? I don't. Berkeley, uh, they make sure it gets deactivated. <laughs> I wish I still had my college email. I got free Adobe Suite. I got free, not free, but discount of Spotify. 
all those free software is gone now. I wonder if my school deactivated my address. I feel like schools are pretty good about deactivating it. No? When I graduated from undergrad, I found out that my class was the last year to have their school emails nuked. Everyone from 2017 onward got to keep theirs. What? That's not fair. My college gave us unlimited Google Drive storage for life. Wow, that's a lot. There's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Holy, this is a lot of screws. That's definitely way more than eight. One, two, three, four. Okay, this is for the plate. Is that the right? Are there more speed? No, I think it is right. What mount is this? It's just top mount. Vincenzo, thank you so much for the prime set. Those stone trays are clean. Error claiming bonus, WTF Twitch. My uni cut teaching staff and classes to save costs, but the vice chancellor still earning big six-figure salary. Smooch. You don't answer the big questions? Oh shoot, what I miss? Did my big questions get lost in the pool? Yes, I don't see Oh, I see it. Do you know any keyboard that are similar to the key cult number 265 Vickery or look similar? I'm gonna say no. The number 265 Vickery had an unfinished bottom, which is pretty unique in my opinion. I mean, if you're if all you're looking for is just a all black keyboard, then you have some options. But what makes the Vickery auction special is that uh, unfinished bottom. Well, I mean, what did you like specifically about the key cult number 265 Vickery? If it's just the overall shape, uh, I guess there are some keyboards that look kind of like a key cult. If it's the color or the finish, then that's pretty unique, I would say. I think. Just find someone that won the victory auction and pay them the winning bid. Did you hear Funimation bought Crunchyroll? Yeah, I, I heard. I saw the article, I think. How much did Vickery sell for? I am not too sure. I don't remember. I think it was over three grand though. It was five grand? Oh, she. <laughs> Damn. Okay, I lied. Oh, the winning bid was five grand. Some people really do it like that, yeah. What was the special board that you have to join the raffle? It's the Key Cult, number 265. <clears throat>
the shape and the overall look I'm looking to upgrade from the NK65. Uh, yeah, I would say Key Cult is pretty unique at the moment, especially the number two. Is this the wrong? Am I supposed to be? How many of these do we have? Two, four, six. You know, I think these might be the wrong screws. It's very important dint. Oh. Oh, it's live? They now have sliders. I wonder how good these will be. Has the Norba Force become, or not Norba Force, the Norba Touch become obsolete? The, sorry, the Nova Touch. Are these better than Nova Touch sliders? Have we finished? Have we achieved peak Topa greatness? They better be? I hope so. I mean, considering... I'm sure it's got input from AIO3 and Kevin Plus. I would buy and compare, but I don't have a Nova Touch anymore. Yeah, same. I also do not have a Nova Touch anymore. I should have hodled my Nova Touch. Aren't they going for like 400, 300 now? You buying into AMC? We all back. Dude, I, I don't know why, but my OBS has been crashing recently. Music is too loud. Oh, whoops. It just like randomly freezes or loses connection for some reason. You need to lose your OB. When are you going to start streaming in 2160 by 1080? Ew. Say it with me. Andy King, thank you so much for the two months. Stream crash? Yeah. Well, it was my OBS. It just loses internet connection. I feel like it's because of the 1440p. Sixteen K stream. Two to one? Dude, I don't think many people are watching on two to one. It's just you, Soran, with the cringe aspect ratio. <laughs> OBS crashed on Subathon 2? Yeah, it's been recent as of late. Something about the recent updates? I don't know. Yeah, I don't have any 2 to 1 monitors. I am all 16 by 9. Is that a Weeha screwdriver? This is a Ramaworks screwdriver. Or not even a screwdriver. What do you think a number two serial number two would go for on Mech Market? Uh, which number two? There are many number twos or versions of the number two. This board, this stream made me want to build a board, just don't have the time today. Sad. But I don't think people care too much about the serial number. Okay. 
key. Let's route the cable this way. You know what? Screw them. Give me the hell one by one stream. Wait, I'm actually kind of down for one by one. I've been thinking. Like, no cap. What if I streamed in six by seven? Or six by nine? Use some good. Good old film day aspect ratios. Let's do that. Let's try that. Uh, overhead. Um, let's unlock it. No. Ooh, why, why is it doing that? <laughs> We're going vertical. We're going dingo music vertical now. <laughs> you want a 2 by one Well, you, you didn't think about this kind of 2 by one huh? 2 by one but rotated 90 degrees. <laughs> is this an insta live stream? No, this is Dingo Music. Don't you guys know Dingo Music? They make videos like this. Oh, maybe they don't. Oh, was it Dingo? A lot of Korean music videos are <laughs> released like this. <laughs> This is not fun. <laughs> you guys like this? Yes or no? Place your votes. Yes or no? don't like the IG live. Hello mouse? Oh. What if you got this? Oh. Cinematic. Oh wait, that's it's way too much though. You guys feel like you're in a movie now? You like my sick 21 by 9? That's fine, I guess. <laughs> Go 4 by 3? Oh god, I am not Snyder. Running at 24? Yes. My, uh, I have my frame rate set for 24 FPS. I feel like, th I feel like in a badly uploaded YouTube video. <laughs> That's because you're on a 2 by one monitor. <laughs> Did you get any of Pingsu round 2? I didn't. I have round 1. And I didn't feel like paying for more. Teha, you are using Yamaha Studio speakers. Yes, I have the HS8s. 
when you're uploading this to YouTube, all my VODs go up 24 hours after the stream starts. Quick question, is frame rate affected by shutter speed when recording video? Uh, yes and... Well, no. Frame rate is frame rate. Your shutter speed does affect how motion appears. So I, I guess it affects it yes and no. But I'm gonna say it doesn't... Like once you set a frame rate, that's set. What shutter speed you set it at then affects how motion blur appears for that frame rate. Shutter speed and frame rate are the same with video? What do you mean? Shutter speed only affects pictures. No, your shutter speed affects how motion appears on film. I mean, I can demonstrate right now. So there, there's motion blur here when I move my hand. So let's say, oh crap, that's the wrong thing. What? What controls my shutter speed? Let's say I make this 160. See, there's a little less motion blur now. It, it almost looks a little bit choppy. I can change the frame rate, the shutter speed again. Now there's less motion blur, it's a little bit. Each frame is more distinct. This is at 250. If I go too slow, this is way too slow a shutter speed. Should I just make all build typing tests like this? <laughs> so yes, your shutter speed does affect uh, how motion looks, but your frame rate is set once you set it. Like once you set a video in 24 frames, like that's 24 frames. Okay, let's put on the keycaps. Uh, we were sent a Zombu mod. Your shutter speed is supposed to be double the FPS you're recording. And that's the general rule, yes. If you want a relatively normal amount of motion, if you want a natural amount of motion blur, then you should generally Double your frame rate. What WTF is that mouse? Mr. Susboard sent this to me. This is the best mouse ever made. Who needs Swiss cheese mice when you can have Iron Man? This set looks like it's calling for white on black. If we're using the Zombumon logo cap, can we just go white on black on this? <laughs> Should I do white on black? I don't think I have an extra set. I would have to use it. Might be like the sixth white on black set of all. White on black is the most hyped set of 2021. Dude, white on black is always hype. 
There's never been a time when white on black was never popular. Cause this set is just goat. Yo, Mr. Nathan, hello! Can't wait to see you this Saturday? Yeah, I can't wait to see your perm. If you guys missed Jim Leader Nathan's stories, he got a perm. Are you gonna diet next? Please tell me you're gonna diet after you recover from the perm. Any updates on merch? Yes, it is on route to me. Production has finished. That is the goal trying to do a white streak? Ooh, okay. Maybe we can overlap silver and white in a couple weeks. Ooh, should we use the RGB mods? We never, we never use the RGB mods. I did get my shipment of RGB mods in. No RGB mods? Oh. I got a natural white streak. Inch Kev, thank you so much for the seven months. What are the reasons someone might prefer box style switches versus MX? Is there a noticeable difference? Uh, it depends. I would say mostly for clicky switches. I don't think there's necessarily a benefit to... Well, okay. I do think box linear switches are smoother out of the box than MX, but that's not necessarily due to the box design. It's just newer molds in my opinion. Uh, tactile switches, likewise. Like box switches have the feature of, you know, self-cleaning itself. I don't think is really something to worry about with MX switches. Um, it could actually be a detriment, in my opinion, if you like lube switches. The, the real area where box switches, <clears throat> where the box design shines, is clicky switches, in my opinion. Box switches don't have plastic on metal friction. Yeah, that is true. Whoa. Well, clicky switches have plastic on metal, but... Our Hyperglide Brown's good. It is uh, dependent on chance. It's batch dependent. You can get good Hyperglide Brown's, you can get bad Hyperglide Brown's. Well, not bad, but just not as great as it can be. But that's that's a gamble you'll play any whenever you whenever you buy any cherry style switch. about box switches stretching keycap stems yeah I think it's still an issue <laughs> these feel really tight I don't think it's been completely fixed maybe it was a good idea I put white on black since I can always repurchase this set <laughs> yeah it's feeling a little tight Fresh set, that is true. No, but I, like, I, it's noticeably tighter. It's not the freshness, I think. And they still have issues with um, 
warpage. Like, your keycaps won't sit straight. That, that still hasn't been fixed either. Does the build commission include the keycaps? Nope, these are my keycaps. You are not required to send in keycaps for the build. Generally, most people don't send in keycaps to save on shipping costs. I just I just put on keycaps so I can do a typing test and take pictures if I want. And then I remove the keycaps before shipping it out. You also don't need me to install your keycaps for you. It's, 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 Installing your keycaps is pretty self-explanatory. Alright, wait, this mouse kind of matches to these build. Or the theme I get, never mind. Ignore what I said. <laughs> we have finished building the jewels. This is the top view. Side view. Feel the, the jades clicking in. Bottom view. There's a USB port. There's a Tlamma logo. And this is the front view. Okay, can we open up the casino? As well as the bot. Oh crap, I need to take a screenshot. Oh, damn. All right, bot is live chat. Place your bets. Is Zombumon Australian? Nope. Three. Oh no, I won't focus. Three, two, one. Three, two, one. Boom. Boom. Love that the bottom has no logo. Yeah. It's pretty clean, I would say. Oh my goodness. Keep in mind, I am typing on clickies today. I am not used to this. Yummy. Say hello. Let Nami do the test? No, no, no. Inch Kev, thank you so much for the seven months. Okay, looks like Casino and Bot are finished. Am I, okay, noise gate is off. This is how loud, oh wait, this is the wrong mouse. <laughs> Where's my MX Master for reference? <laughs> this is how loud the mouse clicks are. I think this might be the first build today where the keyboard is going to be louder in a while. <sighs> Raise my chair. Here we go. Oh my goodness.
It's the backspace. I didn't program backspace. Dude, clicky switches. Are these the move? Oh my goodness, that backspace threw me off. I think I could have broke my PB. Hold on, hold on. Redo, 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 redo. I gotta reprogram this. Uh, okay. Uh, short backspace. Let me reprogram this for you guys. Backspace. That is pipe. Okay, these are what the mods sound like. Dude, I think I'm I think I'm a clicky I'm team clicky now. Yeah, the Rama Artisan sounds really nice. It's deeper. That's pretty deep. Okay, one more. I'm I'm feeling this build. I also need to replace my PB board. I don't wanna I don't like the fact that my stream PB is on a candy bar. <laughs> on a 40%. This might be the run. Oh, you never, we never paid out. Okay, I'll pay out the believers. We'll do one more casino. All right. Start prediction. Oh, you did a new one? Oh, she. <laughs> oh, I just paid out the wrong group. GG. I don't think you can refund that after it's been done. <laughs> it's already too late. I thought you didn't pay out the first group. Oh, Wells. It's okay. What a Mr. Nolan. <laughs> GG. I did the same thing last week. GG. That's why you don't stick your fat finger into someone else's work. Okay, buddy. Okay. What are your thoughts on Leopold keyboards? They're very nice. One of my favorite uh, brands. Whoever wins this next round, you pay out the opposite? Okay. Oh, this prediction's kind of long. The most rigged predictions? Okay, buddy. This is a long ass prediction. That's not fair. I lost twice in a row. <laughs> What's the ratio on this? Wow, 57% believe. Nice. Okay, predictions are closed, I think. Here we go. Here we go.
<laughs> Fudge! Yeah, it's the fatigue. My fingers are already tired. This is so heavy. This is so heavy. Oh my goodness. Guess this was not the run. That's for scamming the doubters? Okay. Do we actually do opposite payout? What does Sorian say? Do we pay the op- Oh, he already paid out. Oh, he paid out the actual group. <laughs> All right. Well, this was the Vern. Turned out nicely. I don't have the, uh, not the, did I say Vern? This is the jewels, sorry, this is the jewels. Yeah, I didn't get to build the Vern twice. Aesthetically, very similar, but different layouts. And a very, another very nice product from Mr. Zombumon. Oh, you can see that black PVD catching in the light. Depending on the lighting, that's pretty nice. New commissions at the end of the month? Uh, we'll see. I think I'm almost done clearing out my backlog though. I have FOMO for the jewels each time I see it. I'm sure there will be extras, Frostfire. Are you still are you still buying a lot of stuff, Frostfire? I remember I remember when Frostfire used to go ham on keyboards. <laughs> yeah, I first I don't think I started talking to Frostfire a lot until until the meme group by I think. And then we started talking. Not really, last board I bought was 378. Uh, makes sense. Makes sense. Whoever's asking about RGB mods, these are it. I don't know if this is what you had in mind, but it's literally RGB keycaps. Are you gonna build a Vertigo or Aurora 65? Not that I know of. Drop test the keyboard? No, this is a client keyboard. Yeah. I wanna to transition to owning TKLs only, but I was tempted by FCFS. Dude, TKLs are the move. <laughs> Where did you get the RGB caps? It's from Novel Key or the group I ran on Novel Key, I believe. Who ran? Was it Heine? Who ran RGB? GMK RGB mods. I think it was Heine that ran this. Was it? I could be wrong. Oh yeah, it was Heine Bush and ADXLK. ADXLK, how's he doing? I haven't heard of him in a while. Okay, what time is it? It's 12.45. I think I'll call it end of stream for today then. Time for lunch? Yeah. Uh, there will be a stream on Friday, I think. I don't know what time yet though. But most likely keyboard related. Uh, any other news? No other news. What are you eating today? I don't know yet. Don't know. When are you uploading the summer song? It's live, Pyongun. It is live. Are there any stores in LA that sell keyboard supplies or is everything online? In LA, uh, there's Divinity. I think they're LA. Bolsa Supply is Orange County. We're ending? Yeah, I'm about to end, Grace. Hello. Uh, T1 build when? I think it's going to be next week. It might have to be next week. Did you get to try Huru's Vertigo during Subathon? No, Dr. Huru didn't bring any boards, I think. I feel like I'm missing something. There was something I wanted to say or do. What was it? Favorite track spa coming next week. What? Hello, Visual Murder. Merch update. Uh, no, I did give merch update. Production has finished. It is en route to me. So hopefully I'll have actual things to 
actual substantial things to leak in a month or two. Probably two months, because we've got to <clears throat> time the photo shoot. But everything's, everything except for the model is locked down for the sh uh, photo shoot. Yeah, I just got him a meeting, hello. Uh, dude, that his looks great, man, I love it, thank you. Spa is Belgian Grand Prix. Oh, I'll be your model. I don't know, should I have multiple photo shoots? I was gonna have a mo photo shoot with like legit models, but it does seem fun to do one with like friends. But in that's Monies. <laughs> I guess I could hire like a friend photographer who could give me a discount. You be the model? I'm too ugly to be a model. I am a model, DM me? No, you DM me, send me your portfolio. I do have models in mind though. I just haven't reached out to him because I don't have a date. Hey from India, hello. What typing test does he use? Monkey type. I am model DM me? Tim Keyless? Yeah, it'd be, it'd be cool to have like a friend, friend one and then a model one. We'll see. Where did you get the shelf? Wayfair. I think friends are pretty personal and appealing to your community. I don't know if my friends are appealing to my community though. You guys don't really know my friends. <laughs> I guess you guys did meet a lot of them during the subathon. But you guys, that was like the first time ever you guys have met my friends. I guess if you guys watch my vlogs, you guys know a little bit more about my friend group. But yeah, well, I'll think about it. Okay, who is live on the Twitch? Ooh, there are a couple people we can raid. Oh. Do you want to watch? What do you guys want to watch? We can do more keyboards. Valorant. I think I'm following some K-pop trainee and she's having a six hour dance practice. Oh my goodness, six hour dance practice. Jesus. Do you guys want to watch someone dancing? Uh, Osu, Genshin. Apex, Valorant, TFT. Who is playing Osu? Abyssal. <laughs> I'm following. Ab I follow Abyssal. <laughs> what's well, what's the dance? Dance keyboard. More keys. Let's raid Sam. Okay, looks like you guys want keyboards. We can give Mister. Sam a raid. It's been a while since we've raided Sam. Sam Pat Pack. What should our raid message be? Oh. When will you die your Pack Pack? I like that. <laughs> that's pretty good. <laughs> oh crap, that's not control. Pack Pack DN like that. <laughs> Alright, he's uh, doing a battle of the budget keyboards. Tofu 60 versus KBD 67 Lite. Alright, have fun in his stream. Ask him lots of keyboard questions. What do you think of GMK Classic Retro Zoo? I love it. I like it. See you on DMs after stream? Okay, I might be driving a little bit, but I'll try to get back to it. I also need to do what you told me to do. All right, thanks for tuning in today. Sorry about the disconnects. I'll see you guys on Friday. Until then, bye-bye. It switches in here. Brace yourselves. Wait, what?